Honduras, who clinched the title of Miss Face of Universe, was greeted by a jubilant crowd led by the new San Rukwe of icons with entertainment provided by the police brass band. Her dedication and hard work shone through as she secured a coveted spot in the top 20, competing against beauty queens from 84 countries. This achievement stands as a testament to her exceptional talent and unwavering commitment to representing Namibia on the global stage. She described her participation in the Miss Universe pageant as a lifelong learning experience she will cherish forever. The 23-year-old vowed to continue with programs aimed at empowering young women. A true proud Namibian woman because when I was on that platform I, I didn't only speak for Namibian women but for African women in general and the fact that I made it through just gave me you know the the sight that they heard me they saw me they accepted me and they acknowledged me. Following the complete acquisition of the Miss Namibia pageant by the National Broadcasting Corporation a commitment has been made to enhance and connect the event more closely with the public as one could witness in both social media and what transpired during her welcoming. This marks a significant milestone for the NBC, especially considering that Namibia was selected as a top 20 contestant since assuming full rights to the pageant. The CEO of Miss Namibia, Umbigarue Upi, expressed her emotion, stating that the feeling of pride is an understatement in light of this accomplishment. I think that proud, to feel proud is an understatement. Uh, I feel beyond proud. And I'm so happy for the support that we got from the Namibian nation. And I just want to say to Jamila, congratulations and well done. We were together there and I saw ex every moment that she was going through. It was not a walk in the park. It was very, very difficult. But Jamila, is a, she is a very tough lady. And also she has, she has high emotional intelligence. She was pre prepared for any outcome. And today, after 20 years, Jamila has put Namibia on the map. She is top 20 out of 84. The beauty queen took a procession through the Independence Avenue, Karitura, Komazdal, with a notable stop at her late mother's residence to pay tribute to her memory. The parade concluded at the NBC TV headquarters on Kalanen Street in the Northern Industrial Area. Johanna Urikos, NBC News, Ventuk.